Good morning, you guys. Welcome to another vlog. It is another horribly wet, rainy day here in St. Louis. It started raining last night and we're supposed to get steady rain for the next two days, which doesn't help the fact that parts of St. Louis is underwater. See, it's raining and it's steady, like it's not pouring. It's just this nice steady rain. And it's gonna be like that for a couple of days. Although you can't see that it's raining, can you? I'm on my computer this morning looking at news and stuff. This is the area that I live in. This is the levee that I tried to get to a couple days ago from that side. And this is the levee that wraps around my town. And as you see, the Merrimack River isn't going to pass it, which is awesome. But then you turn around and this is the road that we drive on. So that's pretty crazy stuff. And then you come up here, this is the famous Highway 141 and 44. This is Highway 44. And then right here is Highway 141. And if you look closely, you know Steak and Shake, that's Steak and Shake. And then there's a Taco Bell and a McDonald's and there's a hotel. This is from KSDK, uh, our news channel here in St. Louis. Yeah, you can see parts of the Merrimack River all the way around here and all the way down there. And it's all the way down this way too. And then you guys saw this in the vlog yesterday. That's just down the street from my neighborhood. Yeah, this is, this is pretty bad. Parts of my town have been under mandatory evacuation but the area that i live in we don't have to be evacuated because we're up on a hill you know the neighborhoods next to mine you know water the merrimack has backlogged into our creek that runs by where i live it's flooded both sides of the street that lead to their neighborhood and so people are trapped in their neighborhood so we have one way out <laughs> uh, which is a pain but you know you gotta work with what you got um, the time this morning is about 9 52 I wasn't able to make it to my 8 30 class because we got a call this morning saying that the road that leads to my school has been shut down because there is water on the road and there's other ways to get to school but I was notified really late and so I messaged my teacher, I'm like, hey, we're having flooding issues, I'm, I'm unable to get to class, but I'm still gonna make it to my, oh, what is it, my 11 o'clock class, I'm gonna leave here in just a couple minutes. The roads are rising, the Merrimack River is, I believe, at 43 feet, uh, right now it still has a couple more feet to go before it breaks 2015's record. Oh, this is a mess, you guys, I don't know how much longer this is gonna go for, but I think this started on Monday night. And it's supposed to go until Thursday or Friday. And part like 44, as you saw, is gonna be shut down probably through the weekend. I have no idea. <laughs> Ew, do I really have to go in that? Okay, it is 10 o'clock. I've got all my stuff back there. Umbrella, sweater. We're gonna see how this goes. <laughs> I don't have class until one hour, but hopefully it won't take me an hour to get to class. Hopefully I'll get there like within maybe half an hour or so, but I can't believe it's raining. This is the worst time to be raining right now. Hey you guys, it is about 1024 and I just made it to the school's parking lot and it only took me about 25 minutes. That's not bad, <laughs> but uh, the highways are a mess just cause. I don't know how long they're gonna be a mess for, but you know what, it is what it is. We are dealing with a very serious flood uh, in parts of St. Louis. So if there's roads open, we're gonna use them. <sighs> it's not even gonna reach 50 degrees today and I didn't bring a jacket, but I did bring an umbrella, that rainbow umbrella. I'm gonna be using that this week. I can't believe it's raining, this is crazy. Yeah, class is at 11. 
It's only 50 minutes long, and then I'm gonna go back home. <laughs> Oh, uh, this is the worst time to have this flood because finals are next week and the week before finals is key. Like it's so important that we be here. It is pouring. I'm so happy I brought my umbrella. My goodness. Shove on my lunch, boy. It's nice and frozen. <laughs> hey, hello, hello. What do you think about the flooding, huh? What do you think about the flooding? And the time is 12:23. Okay, guys. So for lunch today, I am just having some type of yakitori chicken noodle or veggie noodle, some type of Japanese dish. Um, I used to get the yakitori chicken from like Costco, but they discontinued that. So this is the closest thing I could find to what I originally had. But I am having this for lunch, and then the rest of the Doritos, which are all smashed. Um, and then I have a Crustable as well, but it's frozen, so I have to let it sit out and thaw. Guess who's coming to beg food from me? Can I help you? I don't have anything for you. And he'll just sit there and beg the entire time. You're such a beggar. It's annoying. I, I don't like it. So I'm gonna eat lunch here. Uh, for a little bit and relax. Um, we are supposed to get two to four more inches of rain in the next couple days, which means the Merrimack River should be rising about another foot and a half, maybe two feet. Mm, my goodness, this is crazy. But I'm going to get my mind off that by eating this wonderful food and having this annoying beggar next to my side every time every time. Guys, I just got the most exciting news ever. So the time is about 3.15 in the afternoon. I know it's been a little bit of a time gap, but I just heard on the news that the Merrimack River has crested and is now receding, which means it's going down. It's gone down three feet, but since we just had the rain, it's gone up one foot so that's exciting that it's lowering but it's taking a little bit more time just because it's been raining but we're supposed to get more rain tomorrow as well like a couple more inches but i think we've hit the highest possible at the merrimack river so that's good news uh i don't know how long it'll take <laughs> Because there's a ton of water here in St. Louis. So I don't know how long it's going to be. But it is 3.30. I have to take Dylan out. So hopefully I'll be able to go to work tomorrow. Because I haven't been able to make it to work because of the flood. Too many roads have been closed down and I can't get there. Oh, I got a jacket. I got to go downstairs and get Dylan. It's a little cold, huh, boy? I even put on a jacket and I'm... Still shivering. Oh, careful. So I am taking Dylan out right now. Kids should be getting home from school any minute, but that's such good news that the floodwaters are lowering, but we're getting more rain here in a couple days, so it might go up, I don't know, but as of right now, the water is lowering, so that's good. It is now 3.30. Just got back from taking Dylan out. It's over there, buddy. He's over there. Over there. Right there. There you go. Good boy. 
So I have the orders here um, that I'm gonna help my dad pull <sighs> just because he's got a lot of them. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. So yeah, we're gonna do this. It's gonna take a couple of hours and then I'm gonna run them to FedEx. I know there are no road closures where FedEx is. I'm so happy the water's finally going down. Finally. Okay, you guys, I have the packages here and the time is 10 to five. And I'm gonna go ahead and drop off the packages at FedEx as well as run to the bank because I was unable to go this weekend. But hopefully traffic won't be too bad, too bad of a problem or too big of a problem, one or the other. There she is, ladies and gentlemen, the beauty. Just dropped off the packages and now I am on my way to the bank. Right, guys I just made it back from FedEx I'm gonna go ahead and end today's vlog here I've got some Roman noodles or ramen noodles whatever you call it I've got some of that uh, boiling downstairs so I gotta hurry but thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog please give this video a big thumbs up comment down below and subscribe I love you guys super so much and I will see you in tomorrow's vlog bye